Good day, I'm Tevajo Mate with your midday news updates. Lusufi begs Makura's nomination to lead Kauteng. Kele wants politicians who try to vote multiple times. And family and friends divided over Newcastle political murder. Gauteng ANC Deputy Chairperson Panyaza Lusufi has extended his support for Premier David Makura's re-election. The ANC Premier candidates list has been announced after the party's National Executive Committee received three names per province as recommended by the Provincial Executive Committees. Makura has again been nominated to lead Gauteng. Police Minister Begitrael has warned anyone, including politicians, who tried to interfere in the election process and said that they will be dealt with. A day after millions cast their votes in the 2019 national and provincial elections, reports of alleged double voting emerged. The economic freedom fighters Dalimpo, who admitted that his party tested the system. Family and friends of a KwaZulu-Natal ANC member who was gunned down over the weekend are reportedly divided over whether this was a political killing. Martin Sutole was shot dead on Sunday night. He was believed to have been a witness in the trial against murder accused Newcastle Mayor Ntutuko Masaba. Sitole's friend was also killed, while three bystanders were wounded in the incident. And now to your sports news update with Andy Siwe Tsikoto. Welcome to your sports news. My name is Andy Siwe Tsikoto. Serena Williams returns from injury to prepare for their Rome tournament. The American champion is looking to get back to her winning ways so she could reach Margaret Court's record of 24 major singles titles at the French Open, which starts later on this month. Williams successfully defeated Sweden's Rebecca Peters 6-4, 6-2 yesterday and could face her big sister Venus Williams in the second round. Mamelo de Sundowns midfielder from Pokekana has been nominated for the PSL Footballer of the Season. This is the fourth time he has been nominated in this category and hopes to win it this time. Kekana has been one of the PSL's most consistent footballers in the last few years. The Mamelo de Sundowns star has been nominated alongside two creative players, Temba Zwane and Orlando Pirates winger Tembi Lodge, who have also been fantastic. And lastly, the Kosafa Senior Men's Challenge Cup starts on the 25th of May in Deben this year and runs until the 8th of June. The Kosafa Cup features five countries who qualified for the AFCON, which starts next month, and they are South Africa, Zimbabwe, Angola, Namibia, and Uganda. Two players from Cape Town City who are expected to represent their countries in the Kosafa Senior Men's Challenge Cup are Cape Town City's captain Tamsang Namkize and Mozambican International at Milson Dove. That's it from me. Till next time. Bye. And now to your traffic and weather updates. Here's your traffic and weather updates. Johannesburg on the M1, there's a police checkpoint queuing traffic through the Crown Interchange. Southgate on the M1, police checkpoint expect delays at Columbian Avenue Interchange. Medrand on the N1, there's an accident. Two lanes blocked at the Allendale Road exit expect delays. And now with your weather, Johannesburg at 21 degrees Celsius. Soweto at 23 degrees Celsius. Midrand at 22 degrees Celsius and now back to the news desk. And that is it from the rest of the Jovi TV news team. Goodbye. <laughs>